Chinese President Xi Jinping has unveiled the country's new leadership lineup in a twice-a-decade reshuffle. The powerful seven-member Politburo Standing Committee is led by Xi. The others include Shanghai Chief Li Qiang, former anti-graft czar Zhao Lezi, former Party Secretariat Chief Wang Huning, Beijing Party Secretary Tai Qi, Xi's Chief of Staff Ding Xuexiang, and Guangdong Leader Li Xi. This final lineup has been beyond many analysts' most extreme predictions as it marks a clear break from the collective leadership model that's underpinned China's rise. It's also a historic moment because it breaks so many norms, from term limits to early retirement to age norms to female representation as well as resume prerequisites. For example, Shanghai Chief Li Qiang, who is likely to become China's next premier, does not have national governance experience. And for the first time in a quarter century, China won't have a woman sitting on its current 24-member Politburo, marking a major step back in gender representation. What these powerful men have in common is that they've shown the utmost loyalty to Xi and his signature policies. Critics worry, though, that the move could present new risks from lack of opposing voices. Thank you.